Hello. Hi. Hi. I'm Jess. I'm G. And we're the Soul Searching Sisters. We're, we're, making, we're making kimchi today. Right? Today we're going to make something a little bit easy. Something you can use like as a salad-y kind of you know, dish. So yes. it's, it's going to be less pungent. It's okay. not going to be fermented. You can eat it whenever. So quick, like right yeah. after we make it, we can well, eat yeah. it. We don't have to bury it underground or anything. Yeah. No, no, no. Okay, good. <laughs> Because we don't have that here. We don't have dirt. We're going to have to start digging the apartment down. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to need a cabbage. Okay. Um, Chinese cabbage. This is like yeah, Napa cabbage. Yeah, yeah, Napa okay. cabbage. And um, this okay. is the ba basic ingredients. Some spring roll. You can use chive as well. Oh my god. Uh, garlic. Ginger. And of course, chili. Fresh chili flakes from Korea. Yes. Now, we oh, need oh, salt. The salt. salt. Uh, we need fish salt. And this is sugar, and not to be confused with the salt. It's going to be a very um, a casual sort of thing. So what okay. you can do is you can chop it up, or you can even like tear it Ooh. apart. We're going to dump that in a bowl with hands. I'm, I'm going to help you with that, okay. actually. You use your knife while I right. be a little bit more barbaric about things. Oh. You know, so dump it all in. Actually, I'll just do this, and then you, you tear oh, it. Oh, yeah. Why yeah. don't you make the okay. and do all the work? All right, I will. Yeah, absolutely. Are we going to make it really spicy or medium? Oh, yeah. oh OK. Well, we need to um, soak these in salt water for oh. a while. So we're going to pour some salt. OK. And if you have these big grain salts, you know the one, uh, th this is sea salt. Yeah. That's a lot of salt. Watch out for people who have um, sodium problems. Oh, yeah. Just gonna okay. soak it in um, water. Fill it all the way, like covering it, so all of the yeah. So okay. all the leaves are all salted. Okay. You can have a little taste. Okay. Do you taste the salt to make sure it's salty? You want the the vegetable to be a bit, bit wilted. This yeah. kind of ferments it then a little bit. No, not really. No? This one, this one is called kotori. Uh, oh, oops, that's okay. My sugar. Yeah. Pour some sugar on me. Oops, sorry. And how long do you soak this for? For about thirty minutes. Okay. Garlic. Okay. You and I have to start chopping garlic. So. Okay. Um, I'm gonna use probably about uh, like a bowl. Yeah, because like you, you people can't handle garlic. I have this cool device. It's a garlic peeler. That doesn't work. And. White people use this. You put the garlic oh in. Oh my god, that's gonna take you a day. You do this. No, it's really fast. And then look, see, it peels right off. Oh. And I'll show you how the Koreans do okay, it. Okay, so let me see you do it. <sighs> There's not. This is a very small kitchen, by the way. Yeah, I, sorry. <laughs> Usually, ah! I, oh, don't do that. It scared me. All right. <laughs> uh, my mom would actually make. Me, I was like a child labor. Okay. <laughs> Do we all are child labor? Yeah, random stuff. Family. And and that's how you you know earn your meal for the day. Yeah. But um, see, and, they've instilled the values. Now she still makes me do that. Yeah. But I'm still a child labor. <laughs> I'm gonna need a little bit of ginger. Okay. Not too much. I Some love people... ginger. Grandma used to always tell me to eat things because they were good for you, not because they tasted good. That's true. So if she told me that like a donkey's asshole tasted good, we would be eating donkey's asshole every but night. But donkey's assholes do yeah. taste good. And if it, it said they made her look younger, she would totally eat but it. But donkey's. We're gonna use a food processor. Okay. Thank God for food processes because yes. I don't know how. Oh my God! I, we're gonna put some add a, add a little bit of sugar. Just, okay. just a little bit, not too so you're much. You're it. But well, I'm gonna show you the. I'm gonna take show you the ingredients <laughs> later. Anyway, so yes. we'll we're gonna some. put some. Um, Ooh, what oh, is that? No, no, no. Well, what? Um, I want you to try this. No, I don't yes, want you to. Do. <laughs> all Koreans do it. It doesn't smell very good it's at all. It's okay. All Koreans do okay, it. Okay, put it on the spoon. So what is it? It's anchovy sauce. Ew, that doesn't sound very good. So I want you to just try it and tell me. And if you don't have this, I'll tell you what you can use. Oh, it's not bad. If you don't okay. have anchovy sauce, you can use like any fish regular um, Asian fish sauce. Okay. That's basic kimchi paste. The other garlic and everything. Okay, so it's been 30 minutes. We've let every we've let the cabbage soak in the salt brine, and we take a colander and pour it on out. Now, when when your grandma was making kimchi, were you around? Yeah. Were you a child labor? No, not really. So you have like consistency when you're eating the salad. It's not salad. I'm sorry, the kimchi. Corman? Yep. Yeah. Ooh, the special sauce. Mm -hmm. This is what makes kimchi 
kimchi. Mm-hmm. Oh boy. Mm. Why don't we start with that and then see how much? Mm, pussy. <laughs> mm -hmm. So you just basically toss it. Yeah, I mean usually this people is like a like the dressing of a salad. Yeah, people again. use their hands, but oh. your hands will sting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think we should add a little more. See, I told you. Yep. You know, if you're making this for the first time, just keep adding a little bit at a time. So if you yeah, if you, you don't can control spicy, the spice, it's starting know. to smell like it. Yes, it's starting to smell like a good oh Korean my household. God. No, I, you can I, save the chili paste for something else another day, right? Or do you need to use it right away? Um, can you so, use can it for you. anything else? You can make another batch of kimchi. Okay. Instantly make kimchi. This is not the fermented type. A lot of people actually put some soy sauce on it too. Oh, uh, no, okay. soy sauce. <sighs> sesame oil. Sesame oil. Ooh, I love sesame oil. So we're gonna try one with sesame oil and one okay. without. Ooh! Oh, watch out! Exploding sesame oil. So we're gonna. How much? A like a open, open sesame. I think that's enough. That's good. Yeah. I so can totally eat these plain. No, you shouldn't. Okay. Yeah! That's what mom Korean I like it. <laughs> would say. Mm. Yeah, Hajima! Mm. My grandma always had a special Korean name for me. What is it? She would be like, Shogina! <laughs> <laughs> does that mean beautiful girl? Yes, it is. Oh, okay. Uh, it's like 30 minutes to do all of this because the longest part is the brine of yeah. the cabbage. Yeah. And then look at what you have. So I, I want you to try. If you mix it with sesame, make sure you don't um, mix it like <clears throat> before, right before you eat it. So keep oh, it in this bowl first, right, right at the end, yeah. right before you serve it. Yeah. Okay. So there we are. And that's how you make kimchi. Ta-da! Ta -da.